What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the, the next adventure, and that is we're going to be going back to Slateport City because there is a little something, something that we kind of want to do, and that is, uh, yes, we need to uh, go back to the ferry because I guess there's some battles waiting for us. Probably, maybe, I do not know. It has been a while, guys, so... Let's go back to Slateport. Let's uh, take care of business right here, and uh, let's see what let, let's see what, what what else we can actually you know accomplish right here in our pretty cool episode of uh, Pokemon. Of course, it's not really cool and all that stuff. So here we are in Slateport City, and there is, I believe, there is a second option of going into the ferry, and this time going, you know, maneuvering yourself in there. All we need to do now is talk to this guy, and I guess, uh, okay, so he's already, he's already talked to us about that. So what needs to happen is, yes, we're showing her the ticket, and what do we want to do? Let's go to Lily Cove City. Yes. And, let's see. Does this do anything for us? There it is. Okay, so here we are in the SS title, I think. Hope uh, you enjoy your voyage on our ferry. Okay, so we're going to be doing some battles right here, guys. Lots of battles. Many battles. And I think this is not my room. And he's going to be looking at us. He's like, are your friends strong? Probably. I don't know. We will find out. Here we're taking on Gentleman Tucker. Coming with his Rapidash. Look at this. Rapidash is looking all majestic AF and all that crud. And here comes Crobat. Or Toxic Batman for short. Let's go Venishok. Anywho, in our last episode, guys, we, we did quite a few, quite a few things, and, uh, what was it that we did? Oh, yeah, in our last episode, we managed to get ourselves both, uh, both bikes. That way, we can start traveling around with, you know, without any kind of hesitation or anything like that. If you ask me, I kind of wish they would have added that whole event, like, earlier on, not... A post game kind of deal because you know there 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 were some situations that you know it could have helped if we had both bikes. I'm just saying, Nintendo, come on, you really uh you really screwed the pooch on this one. So let's go with Shenron because we're about to take on a Zip Striker. Alrighty, okay, bring it. And here is here is Shenron himself. And well, the airlock has come on. Let's go with a Dragon Pulse right here. Look at this. Shenron for the win yeah buddy again Rayquaza is just the Pokemon that is like OP it is crazy OP and well your friend you are friends indeed strong yes we are strong the strongest force with all of us okay so let's see talk to this nothing and if uh, we're gonna be going back right here we're gonna be going through every single door seeing what's up and uh, here is a rich boy it seems to me that a whole bunch of the, the elite come over here. And I'm not talking about the elite four. I'm talking about, like, financially elite. So, here we are taking on a rich boy Garrett. Coming out with his furfrow. And he's, uh, yeah, he, he, he's, he's kind of got it all tidied up and everything to go. So, let's go with the Giga Drain. And, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and beat this poodle. And talks to Batman, getting some, uh, yeah, definitely getting some HP back, but losing some HP at the same time. And there's some damage recoil. So let's go with a fly attack. Let's go, Toxic Batman. And there we go. Avoided. And another Sucker Punch. So here we go. Fly attack. Nearly for the win. And we're going to go straight for a Venishock. But, you know, we were a little too... Early to, 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 to say anything because, yeah, there's a heal. So here we go, Venishock yet again. No poisoning. This guy is going to definitely try to heal up his Pokemon as much as possible. So here we go, Fly Attack. And, well, the Fly Attack is, you know, it's probably our best attack right now. And here comes a Charm Attack. Grab, crap, crap. Okay, so let's see. Venishock. And just like that, there you go, Furfrau, defeated. Probably should have started with Tommy JDF. I'm just saying. Okay, alrighty. 
So that's that. And, well, let's go right ahead and switch up our Pokemon. You know what? Guy of the Fierce Knight has not gotten any kind of love right here. So let's go ahead and, uh, you know, let's give it a little bit of love and continue on our little adventure right here. So there are doors in front and side and all that stuff. And, yeah, there's going to be some Pokemon trainers all over the place. Anywho, let's see. Um, huh. What is, what is up there? Let's see. I'm trying to look for my phone right here. Oh, there it is. Oh, would you look at that? Bravaria. Bra Bravari. Uh, meet this Moonblast. For the win. There we go. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at that. That is a victory. Oh, yes. Big old victory right there. And, well, that is a victory for Toxic Batman because it, it, didn't, it didn't need to do anything. Just live and, uh, you know... All that fun stuff right there. Okay, so that's a that's another trainer again, and uh, well, there's a there's a trainer right there in the other room. So we might as go into this section and see what's up. Uh, hi, I'm not acting suspicious. Uh, you can have this for free. It, uh, honestly, it's not a licensed item. It, that's just embargoed or anything. It's totally legal. You can use it. And, well, there it is. We get ourselves the TM-63 Embargo. And that right there is going to help us with, you know, any any kind of Pokemon that has a similar moves or whatnot. And, as you guys can see... But I thank you for coming along. Briny, it's like the good old days, having you guide uh, the rudder again after all this time. And it's great to see Pico again, too. Pee pee! Oh, look how thrilled Pico is to see her old pal Drake. Not the rapper. Uh, but no need to keep going on about it, mind you. Uh, anywho, it's uh, a short crossing, so drink it all in, huh? Well then, I'll see you later. Full speed ahead, Briny. Aye, aye, old friend. Full speed ahead. And that is Drake from the Elite Four. So I'm guessing that you won't be able to go to the Elite Four until you come in here and, uh, you know, take care of business and all that stuff. What do you have to say? Oh, you're such an adorable trainer. Would you like to have some tea? Or would you rather battle? I would rather do both, to be quite honest. Tea is pretty good for you. So, let's go right ahead and take on a Persian. Look at that, Persian. Okay, Persian. Time to meet your doom. Psychic attack. Yes, psychic attack will work. But it is using, I think, a taunt attack? Or wait, wait, what is it using? Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so it has a special attack ready and waiting for us. And thankfully... Persian can't handle the psychic attack. Yes. Alrighty. And, well, look at this. Gaia grows to level 7 or 67. And Annette has been finished. Yes. We are winning. Okay. Alrighty. So, what is the next thing we need to do around here? Ah, we can go right here before we can talk to, you know, Mr. Briny. And this is a Poke fan. So, let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. And, you know what, Tommy JDF, he's gonna just whoop everybody's you-know-what. Go back and forth, Lily COVID Slateport, that's what I do. It's my hobby, going from port to port to take uh, Pokemon Contest Spectaculars. Which is, you know, a, a very nice place. A very, very nice place to do, or place, or thing to do, especially in uh, this region. And, well, here he's coming out with a Del Caddy. And... Well, let's see. Let's go straight for a Sky Uppercut. Oh, my God. And we flinched and we couldn't move. Okay, let's try this again. Sky Uppercut. You gotta love that sound. You really do. And there you go. Defeated. And, well, let's see. Who else next? Okay. Del Caddy wants to take on us. And, well, let's go right ahead and use a Sky Uppercut yet again. Look at that. Sky Uppercut on Del Caddy. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty. And, you know, wow, we nearly grew a level right there. And here comes another Del Caddy. So let's go right ahead and use Tommy JDF yet again for another Sky Uppercut. You gotta love this. This show you can. You know, show you can. And there we go. That's how you do it. Thank you, Jeebus. And bam. Look at that. We grow to level 74, and Colton is no more. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so 
Who is next on the list? Maybe I should check those trash cans just in case, you know, there might be an item here and there. That could be something. And uh, before we talk to this guy, let's go into this room, and it's a double battle. So let's go right ahead and... Uh, I w you know what? Screw it. Let's go right ahead and use Thunderball, and <coughs> Shenron can, uh, you know, take whatever it can. It, it does have, it does have the ability to, you know, withstand anything. So here we go, taking on another couple. Let's see what they can do. Young couple Leah and Jed, and they are both going to be coming out with Miltank and Tauros. Holy crud! Okay, so this is. Yeah, this is uh, this, yeah, this is not gonna fare very well. So, let's go with a discharge attack onto everybody. And you know what? <coughs> let's be <coughs> let's be OP on this. Let's go and destroy Mill Tank right here. So let's go and evolve. Let's mega evolve onto this. And. Well, the Delta Stream has started, so all flying type Pokemon will have some kind of uh, some kind of ability, and everybody's getting hit. Shenron doesn't feel a single thing, but here comes Dragon Ascent for the win. Bam! Yeah. Oh yeah. There goes Mill Tank. Now ma imagine battling inside a boat and having to see this. That is ridiculous. Holy buckets. Well, here comes a thrash attack. Alrighty. Okay. Time to go with a, ch a charge or discharge or, I don't know, charge beam. And a dragon pulse. And... <coughs> there you go. Tauros defeated. Okay. Alrighty. And everybody's growing levels, including Thunderball right here. And, well, that right there brings Leviathan to level 74. And just a little bit more for us right there. Yes. Alrighty. So, let's see. Trash can. Got to check the trash can. Not Dunster Diameter or anything, but just I'm just saying, guys. Alright, let's talk to Mr. Briny right here. Well, welcome aboard, Draven. They made me the honorary captain of the this here SS title. You can call me Captain Briny now. You know, I retired once before, but when I saw this fine ship launch, let me say it stirred up my old sailor soul, eh? It did. Okay. That's pretty awesome. And this is cabin two. Of course, this will be our cabin. And again, taking a look at the trash can. And I guess we can uh, we can heal up right here. Now, once you do this, it's, uh, you know, once you do that, your Pokemon are going to be fine and heal and all that stuff. Now, I would have preferred getting a PC too. But as you guys can see, once you heal up your Pokemon, you will be landing at Lily Cove City shortly. Thank you for visiting all of us. When you get off the ferry, please speak to the crew at the entrance. Hmm. Now there is one more place that we can go to before we finish off and is the outside. Now if you go out here into the ferry crew or ferry, you will be able to find yourself the Blastoise Knight. Pla Blastoise at Knight. Yeah, that's what it's mentioned. But yes, you'll be able to find Blastoise's Mega Evolutionary Stone there. And there was a big, big Whale Lord breaching just now. Oh, by the way, breaching is what you call it when a Whale Lord or a Whelmer jumps uh, as high as it can for everyone on the ship. Huh, that's pretty cool. And there was a weird old guy in the front, uh, front of the bow. Okay. And... Such an elegant moment as I gaze uh, out upon the interminable sea. My slack off is pleased too, so I'm glad I brought it along. Then again, slack off is pleased by anything, if it doesn't move or anything. Could you scoot over a bit more? You say you did say you wanted to sit in the seat on the deck. Okay, glug. Hmm. Now an old man. Yes, it's our old buddy Drake, not the rapper. He's like, oh, it's you. How about it? How's the old SS title treating you? I can tell from the breeze on my skin that my old friend has got it. Uh, still got it. Yes. And it, this is a very beautiful, a very beautiful view. So, I think that's pretty much it right there, guys. Look at that. Yeah, we've done quite enough. And, uh, well, let's see. Go visit the other cabins. Okay, yeah, we've already battled everybody. Now, if we go downstairs here, 
you'll be able to find yourself some, uh, yeah, some Pokemon trainers ready to battle too. Uh, let's see, we're gonna find ourselves some leftovers, so don't forget about those guys. And well, let's see. Talk to talk to one of these two. This is the bottom of the ship's hole. There's plenty of room. It'll be all right for a Pokemon battle. Okay. Another Pokemon battle. Let's get it. Taking on Floatzel. And, well, Floatzel, meet Thunderball. Thunderball, meet Floatzel. This is not going to be pretty. Here we go. Discharge attack for the win. <coughs> and Floatzel, not happy whatsoever. And, well, let's see. Here comes Pelipper. So we're just going to keep Thunderball out here just uh, to mess with everybody. Ah, look at that. It's smiling all deviantly. And there we go. That's right. Discharge for the win. And, well, that's a little bit more right there. And Sailor Leonard has been defeated. And he's like, big bro, I lost. You have. We're the cleanup brothers. The old one dumps the detergent and the young one does the scrubbing. So that's probably what they were, they, they were doing. So... Let's go ahead and give Leviathan a little bit of love since, you know, we have yet to use it. And who is this guy? Let's see. Oh, it's a local kid. Hulu. Me from Unova region. Me no talk uh, pretty, you understand. Yeah, okay, so I know who this guy is. The way he talks, it's very familiar. We've met him twice before, both in Pokemon Black and... You know, the Heart Gold, Soul Silver series, or, you know, Gold, Silver, Crystal series. Oh, you understand me talk? Me so happy, so relief. Very, very uh, happy feeling. So I give I give this you take. And we're going to get ourselves a Sharp Beak, which is always good. It a Sharp Beak you give to flying Pokemon type. I wish I Sharp Beak like Beak. Uh, then I learn original language quick. I not Sharp be uh, Sharp Self, but learning new language really fun. Yes. Yes. So if you guys remember, the only person that ever talks just like that happens to be the old Team Rocket member that, well, you know, kind of took the generator and whatnot. So, yeah. Anywho, let's go ahead and take on Sailor Philip, and he's going to be coming out with his quillfish right here. Alrighty. Let's go. Let's get it. Alrighty, so quillfish, how's it going? Time to take a Dragon Pulse because, well... Yeah, there's really nothing else that we can do. So here we go. Dragon Pulse for the win. And Leviathan just, you know, kicking some butt. And here comes Machamp. Okay, so we've been waiting for you, Machamp. Not really, but we've been waiting. Let's go with a Surf Attack. And just like that. Yeah, buddy. Defeated Machamp. Okay. And Failer, or Sailor Philip has been defeated. I'm feeling happy about that one right there. Okay, so I guess we have defeated everybody in this uh, this boat right here. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and just get back to Lily Cove, I guess. We've arrived! And would you look at this, guys. We are back... Where you know everything has started, I think if we talk to this guy, he's gonna be like, "Yes, I was finally on operation." Okay, okay, so that's cool. He's just you know complimenting the people at Slayport. Anywho, this will be the episode, guys. In the next one, I think we're gonna be doing something in the Safari Zone, something very minor, I think, since we have both bikes. Other than that, guys, I want to say thank you, thank you for being patient, thank you for uh, you know for staying on here. I'll be back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. See you guys.